So we're still having some difficulties, but the great news is that we can record this little video uh, along with all the other videos. And I've got a couple of things I want to tell you about. It's so important that we came outside uh, to film this announcement. Last week we took up an offering for uh, churches in Kenya and Zimbabwe affected by uh, COVID-19 and the economic uh, disaster that's unfolding uh, because of it. And we asked you to give and to give generously. And uh, I'm really delighted to let you know how much was given. Uh, we were just going to use a slide for this, um, but um, instead we've had to use a slightly less technical um, thing of writing on a piece of paper. So, wow, there you go, £18,074. But the, the thing with this is that's actually what was given in the first 24 hours. Um, we've actually got a, bit, a bigger number and a better number, which is how much has been given in total so far. Let me have a look. Oh, here we go. £41,480. Isn't that amazing? £41,480. 2 Corinthians 9 verse 11 says, you will be enriched in every way so that you can be generous in every way. And it then says, which through us will provide, uh, will uh, cause thanksgiving to be given to God. And I just want to say on behalf of the elders, we thank God for your generosity. For those of you who are part of Kings and those of you who have just connected to this offering and have given as well, I've had people from outside uh, Kings membership giving too. It's so wonderful. We praise God for you. And the churches in Zimbabwe and Kenya, they're going to be praising God so much when they receive your generosity. Thank you so, so much. One other thing I just need to share with you, which is that uh, we wanted to find out how you're doing during lockdown and as the restrictions ease and we work out what we do next as a church, uh, we've got some uh, decisions to make, some plans to make. And so we put together a small survey, which we'd love you to fill in. Uh, hopefully the link will go in the comments, but you will have got a news email about it on Friday and it will be in Tuesday's news email as well. It's just a short survey. We'd love you to fill it in. Over 60 people have done that already. And so uh, please just fill that in, let us know where you're at, what's up, what you're thinking and what you're hoping for as we make our plans.